I'm in a 1988 Oldsmobile Cutlass Supreme International Series. It has a 2.8 liter engine, 130 horsepower, four speed automatic. Final drive ratio is 3.31 to one. It seems fairly aggressive, but honestly it's not. It really isn't. Uh, we're gonna eke out some zero to 60 times on this thing, see what it can do. I haven't been able to find any road test magazines to, to give me some indicator of what it can do in terms of performance. Uh, if you have the impression that this thing is fairly gutless, yeah, 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 you're right. It is, it is gutless. However, for the era, for 1988, it's fairly spirited, it truly is. And uh, let's just see what we can do. Now there's no OBD port on the car. We're gonna go old school stopwatch. I'm gonna drop it into, we'll drop it into to drive. And we'll try that. We'll start with that first. And uh, we're just gonna rev up the engine, load up the power, get it to say 2,500 and release. Oh, some wheel spin, baby. Floored, get into the street. Where are we gonna stop at? Uh, I'm trying to do this. Go, 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 go. For real? 13 seconds? Ugh. All right, 13 seconds is not what I expected. It actually feels more powerful than that. I, I don't know if it was something I'm doing, but we're gonna give it another go. Uh, it's kind of hard to steer, stopwatch, and uh, and watch the speedometer and drive all at the same time. We're going to give it another shot, though. This time, I'm not going to be on the shoulder. I'll start off in the middle of the road, make sure there's no cars behind me, and we're going to give it a go. We're better centered in the road now. Load up the engine, 2,500 RPM, and go. Full throttle. Go, baby. Oh, come on. Go, 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 go. 50. 55, 57, 57. Ah, I may have stopped just a second early. All right, a little better time. All right, under 12. Let's get centered up here. I'm not gonna load up. I'm just gonna smash the throttle, hit start, and let's see what goes. One, two, three. Ah! missed it so there you have it i went back and looked at the footage 12.8 seconds to get to zero to 60. i think if i was racing a tesla i think a tesla would be doing 160 in that same amount of time but for the era i mean that's what the expectation was i don't think it was terrible actually i think the car feels more spirited than it really is but that's a zero to 60 in a 1988 oldsmobile cutlass supreme international thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next video